nerds. So for this video, I am going to be unboxing this uh, Reservoir Dogs. This is the uh, Mezco. Uh, sorry, I'm blocking myself. Stuck in the middle with you box set. I'm going to be opening this. Um, and it's got Mr. Blonde and then Miss Copper in here. And, uh, and it's got like a desk and stuff, some great accessories. And I'm going to be opening that up. And I think that this is, a, uh, this is an older uh, set. I got this off eBay. Um, that's where you would, you would find stuff like this. Or, you know, like, uh, uh, what's that one? Mercury. I think that's what that app is. You would just find something like this on, on something like that. Or like Craigslist or something like that. Um, but I'm going to open it just because I, I saw, I found it and, uh, you know, I wanted this for a while and, uh, yeah. All right, here we go. Let's open it. All right, you guys. So this is the box and we're going to open it up. This is really good packaging. Um, you know, I always think that the packaging is, is really good sometimes on figures. So this is the figures and we're going to, this is a little diorama they got. It's, it's plastic with cardboard on the back, but it's still really, really good. I like it and everything. All right. So let's get these figures opened up. We're going to nip all these little wiry things just uh pop these suckers open here is the police officer in the chair i don't remember his name in the movie his ear does come off i'm not gonna pull it off and everything um just because i don't know i don't know if i can get it to go back in um but this is the figure um i think it looks pretty good so far you know it's just one piece and everything all right let's get uh mr blonde opened up and everything taken out of the package uh first we have this table um that's really fun you know, and then it comes with this radio where he plays that famous song. I'm not going to play it because I don't want to get copyright striked. Uh, and then we've got, uh, sorry, I moved the, the, moved the diagram. Then we have this little thing of tape. Um, that's supposed to be a roll of tape. And then we have this gas uh, canister. And then we also have a, a hand, an extra hand for Mr. Blonde. And then it also comes with a switchblade that actually opens up. I think that's pretty cool very good accessories for this all right and then um finally oh we also have a gun yeah that's pretty cool um and then we have the figure of mr blonde now he does have some articulation the the shoulders they just move up and down um and and then that the arms they bend at the uh the elbow and then we have the legs they bend and twist at the knees around the knees um he's shaped kind of oddly but you know he has the holster for the gun in case you want to have him holding that switchblade and these are the two figures i think they are pretty solid let's take a, a better look at them in the diorama so here they are all set up with that famous iconic scene from reservoir dogs i think that this looks great i mean i think that uh they did a good job making these figures you know, uh, you know, that doesn't really look like uh, what's his face, <laughs> the actor, but uh, I still think the figures are cool. That's very, very cool, very bloody and everything. Um, you know, I think that it, it sets up a, a mood for this, this, uh, this diorama and this, uh, these action figures. I really do like it a lot. I think it's pretty great. Um, yeah, yeah, I think these are, I think these are solid. I think this would be great in anybody's collection. I mean, just look how cool this scene is. All right, you guys. So tell me, what do you guys think about this, this figures, these figures? Um, I think it's really great. I mean, you know, this, uh, this copper here doesn't really move or anything, but I think that this is great if you're like a person that likes to take, oh, take pictures and set up your action figures and then take pictures for like Instagram. And then this figure I think is really great. I mean, if you didn't use him as Mr. Blonde, you could totally use him as like a, a, a detective or something like that. He looks very detective-y. And I just think that, um, you know, I mean, as far as articulation goes, it's not the best, but, you know, it was a different time back then uh, when these figures came out. Um, but yeah, I do. I I do like it. I do like it. And it's got that diorama in the back there. And I just think it's uh, it's really great. So if you have these, what do you guys think about it? If you don't have it, is this something that you're interested in? Uh, go ahead and leave all your comments in that section down below. If you like this video, go and hit the like button. You know I won't mind. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And we'll see you guys on the next unboxing uh, of an action figure. You guys have a good day. Bye.